Good Day Cabilders, a Singapore-like Cebu City, envisioned by newly inaugurated Cebu City Mayor Michael Rama. Let's take a look, mga cabilders. Newly inaugurated Cebu City Mayor Michael Rama envisions Cebu City to be Singapore-like. In his inaugural speech on June 2022, Rama said that he needs the help of all stakeholders in the city to achieve this dream to make Cebu City a highly developed city. Will you support me? Will you support the city government? This is my new term. We must make it successful, said the mayor. The mayor also sought the help of the Cebu City Council led by newly sworn in Vice Mayor Raymond Garcia to achieve the goals of the city as legislative support is crucial to the major projects of the city. Rama said in the next three years, he plans to finally finish the long-awaited bus rapid transit BRT system, as well as begin the studies for the light railway system, monorail system, and cable cars, to provide mass transport to the growing number workers in the city. Subways, viaducts, widened roads, and other infrastructure projects should import connectivity in the city from the hinterlands to the coastal areas. His plan to make Cebu City just like Singapore is far from over. Recently, Mayor Michael Rama said he will issue an executive order that will focus on the recovery of sidewalks and the restoration of setbacks as a means to help solve the city's congestion problems. In the days going forward, we will have to focus on the recovery of sidewalks and setbacks. And I am very proud and talked with ex-secretary Mike Dino. He also will take the lead, and I wish Cebu City Councilor Mary Ann de los Santos will be helping him in recovering sidewalks and setbacks, especially Gikan Deary saw Immaculata on the way to Busai. Rama said, and while he is yet to specify the date for the issuance of his new EO, Rama already identified personalities who will lead this aggressive and massive restoration campaign. Since he assumed the office of the mayor on July 1st, Rama has been focused on implementing programs that will lead to the fulfillment of his dream to make Cebu City Singapore-like. Cebuano started to get familiar with the term Singapore like Cebu City when Rama used it as the highlight of his inaugural speech on June 30, 2022. Singapore is practically a smart city, globally competitive, disaster resilient, and Singapore has a per capita that you cannot ignore, said Rama, explaining to Sunstar Cebu why he chose the Lion City as a model for Cebu's development. Standing in the way of Rama's dream to turn Cebu into another Singapore is the lack of a budget to fund new projects. The city's local finance committee LFC disclosed last August 8 that the city had spent more money than its income for the past two years. Last August 30, the city government reached a milestone after after it fully paid the loan used for the development of the South Road properties. In 1995, the Cebu city government had received a 12.315 billion yen loan, equivalent to P4.65 billion at the time, from the Japan International Cooperation Agency through Land Bank of the Philippines to construct the South Road properties, a 300-hectare reclamation project. This has technically made Cebu city debt-free, but Rama said taking out a new loan to fund his Singapore-like dream is far-fetched now. That's it for today Cabilders, what can you say about this Singapore-like, Cebu City dream, comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos like this. We share different topics every day. Thanks for watching, see you on the next video.